All right, everybody. So in this section, we're going to discuss um, exhaustion and exhaustion wicks. Now we already discussed the trend, um, the introduction. We already discussed candlesticks. Now what you will see when you look at exhaustions is this is basically an exhaustion. Okay. Now this right here means that there's no volume to the upside. Okay. Now if you get a candlestick on the contrary side for example if you get something like this what is this showing us there's literally no interest in going to the downside okay now don't get clued up with this just this one thing this is just showing exhaustion but when it's when we get one thing that we call a wick fill now the wick fill is we, we will do that later but that comes with momentum but just focus on the exhaustion for now now when we get an exhaustion zone for example let's say we get a zone like this now what the, what does this tell us if this creates a zone to the right hand side what is this this is telling us that if we get a zone in the near future to this level what is most probably going to happen the market is probably going to test it probably break it a little bit but then just come back down and wick because there is no interest for buyers at this current level at this current stage at this current market conditions so the chances of the probability of it doing exactly the same thing are very high let's look at current market conditions exactly what i just said look at this 